Today, Kevin and Andrew and I are going to be trying three different items. These are sent to us from Claire and Arlen, so thank you very, very much, Claire. We really appreciate it. Um, two of them are from Marks and Spencer. I have the M&S British Clotted Cream and Strawberry Fudge. And I have sugar-free rhubarb and custard drops. And Andrew, what do you have? Oh, yours is from Marks and Spencer, too. I didn't notice. All three of them were from Marks and Spencer. I have Percy Pig. Soft gums made with fruit juice. Look, look how creepy that looks. Percy look Pig. Nice. I know. Pig. When I first opened the package, I said, it looks like Peppa Pig. I said, I bet Gavin would love those. And you could tell him they were Peppa Pig, and he would believe it. He wouldn't know any different. Let's try your Now, first. it does say, the only kind of flavor I can find on here is apple, mandarin, elderberry. Okay. So, elderberry, red grapes, macarons, whatever. Okay. So we're gonna eat a Percy Pig. Oh, I didn't even see the detail on the ears. I'm gonna, I will take a close up because uh, mm -hmm. that, my picture did not show the two-toned detail on, on the pig. That's a little creepy looking. It's really chewy. But it's also really good. Those are pretty good. If I don't eat them, Gavin will. Yeah, it's funny. They're they're you know gummy what? snacks, but they're soft gummy snacks. Well, they're a little hard. They're a little chewier. Than... I don't know that Gavin would be able to have those. They're too chewy. Mm -hmm. I think Gavin will get choked unless you cut it up. I would. It's not a chewer. Take a pair of scissors and cut them up. Cut mm -hmm. that in about four pieces, and then Gavin can have it. Gavin's not a chewer. No. He's just sticking his mouth and swallowing. Yeah, so <laughs> for him, he could have that if it was cut up. That actually is really good. It yeah. has a really good fruit juice flavor. Like, yeah, are, if you like gummies, then. Yeah, and you could make that last. You could suck you on could. that and really make it last a long time, couldn't you? Mm hmm. Okay, I, I have the. Um, I would do, but you wouldn't? It's right up your alley. Um, I have the British Clotted Cream Strawberry Fudge, deliciously soft fudge made by experts with Dorset Clotted Cream and Strawberry Pieces. We're just wondering why you would use a word like clotted. What is clotted cream? What is that? Somebody comment, please, and tell me what clotted cream is. Let's get the scissors. I did not. Or I can just look it up job. and not be late. Or you can comment and tell me. Ah. Ah. It smells really good. I got a really big one. Want to split it? Sure. Snap right in half. Now that looks like a serving. Mm-hmm. The other ones are all like that. Daddy's tearing it in half. That's very good. The flavor is good. Though. I don't I cream is if you like, if you like uh, strawberries, you would really like well, this fudge. I've never had fudge with strawberry. I really like that. You don't care for it? It's a creamy flavor. Oh, I don't. Right. I like no. that. Oh, you that, don't like that? What is that? That cream? What is that? It's clotted cream. No, old Nene used that all the time on stuff, and the fourth cream. Cream. Needed. What? No, it, no that's, that's a cream. certain thing. It ain't with cream. This, this is, uh, I like them. I think they're really good. But I don't think they're bad. They're a little strong. Cream. Is it like a, it's not cream cheese. I, I understand if it's not, not for everybody, no, like but I like that sour quite cream? a bit. No. Not sour cream. Not she, cheese. She used that on buttermilk. Buttermilk type deal. And then she would take Cool Whip and put it on cake and call it icing. That's a travesty. <laughs> That's a lie. These are hard candies. And she got mad at me every time I called her out on it. She, she, yeah. These are rhubarb and custard. Mm. My dad used to have a rhubarb plant growing in his backyard. And it, Is and it a root vegetable? I don't know. It's like, it looks like a celery stalk almost, but it's really tall. His were like this tall. And they were pretty tall. It's not bad. And the red. But it tastes like a vegetable. That's kind of what it's the rhubarb a, is. I don't what? like it. Did you eat yours? It's a sucker. Oh. I don't like it. 
It's not bad. It's not something, Claire, that I would buy all the time. I feel like an old woman would give you this in church. What you want to hurt me? There you go. I didn't think it, I didn't think it was was bad. It's just not something I would buy all the time. It's I would, weird. If I'm going to have a mint like this to suck on, I would rather have um, something minty. Something to freshen my breath. And I don't feel like these would freshen my breath. So... But I just I, think there's people that make whole pies with that flavor. I can't imagine. And then rhubarb. Y'all ain't got to the middle yet. <coughs> so anyway, out of the three, I think I like the Percy Pig the best. Probably the Percy Pig. Yeah, Percy the Percy Pigs. Pig. I, I would buy those here. Those are really good. The the fudge was good, mm -hmm. but it's not something creamy. I would buy all the time. But the Percy Pig would be one that I would buy all the time. So thank you very much, Claire. I'll have pictures at the end as usual. And thanks for watching.